I've commuted, done nothing but commute my entire college career, and um, it's horrible. I can't go into the, uh, the detail about how much I have hated commuting and college my entire life. <laughs> Hi, um, my name is Mike Bienes. Um, I'm a former student at Buff State. Um, I went there for two years. Um, it was just the best time of my life. I think so. I mean, I wouldn't trade it for anything, you know? I mean, there's a lot of memories that uh, I have at Buff State. Just countless memories. Um, they, I wrote them down in my notebook, which uh, I don't have on me. It was unbelievable. I met people. I had friends. They had friends that I met because they were friends with them. And um, I, I get teared. I get teary thinking about how I, I just loved everything about them. But the second year, um, I wanted to blow my brains out. You know what? Let me turn the tables on you. What do you think about the question? I didn't dorm. Let me tell you right now. If you're going to have kids and you're not going to have them dorm in college, it. kill them. Just, you might as well kill them because they're not going to have fun. Ever. I drove my stupid car 30 minutes to class every morning. I don't know why you're taking notes. It's creeping the hell out of me. It's just a Worst. Some would say I'm a weak person for not being able to do that, but I would say F you. When I graduated from high school, I was um, I was real excited to go. Um, I mean, what what uh, high schooler really isn't excited to go to college? How many movies? are out there that have all these ideas of like crazy parties and all the people you're going to meet and you know how much fun it's going to be. There's never any movie that shows like that, that it's horrible um, and it can be. It can be really really horrible. It just it tricks you especially I believe if you're a commuter. I feel like when you get older you forget how to make friends kind of. I'd get out of class and I'd be like, what should I do now? Because I have two hours until my next class, what should I do? And uh, I mean, I really just wanted to go home. If I went home, there was no way I was coming back for my second class. And unfortunately, more often than not, I did go home because there was nothing else for me to do. Fall semester, I finished, of freshman year, I finished with a .86 GPA. Um, I failed two courses. I had um, one C and a D, and I withdrew from another class. They sent home a letter saying that they were kicking me out of school. I had very little choice but to go to ECC. I also got involved in the school. I tried out for the soccer team. I was a starting goalie. Um, I was the captain, um, and I loved it. I loved showing up at the field. Uh, I loved being on the team. I met a lot of guys through it. I could, you know, hang out at the in the lunchroom and like sit at the same table as some of these people and talk about soccer or school or whatever. And I felt much more like I belonged. <laughs> driving to class one day and this car was getting on the uh, through it and uh, he wanted to merge like right into me and I said no I don't want that to happen to me so I didn't let him merge into me he ended up crashing I 
I didn't. Um, it really wasn't that bad for me, but I mean, he, if he was commuting, it was probably pretty bad. Me, not so much. Him, yes. 